Every Spider-Man Ever, Amazing Spider-Man number 6. In Florida, a half-man, half-lizard is running Rampage. The Daily Bugle challenges Spider-Man to defeat the creature who they call the Lizard. But J. Jonah Jameson refuses to send Peter Parker. It wasn't a real challenge, he just wanted to sell papers. So instead, Peter visits a museum's dinosaur exhibition to learn more about lizards. While there, he fought a robbery turned kidnapping, saving Liz Allen and having her swoon over Spider-Man. But the lizard is still at large, so it's time for Spider-Man to pay J. Jonah Jameson a visit. After some convincing from Spider-Man, Peter Parker is on his way to Florida to find the lizard and maybe visit a local reptile expert, Dr. Kurt Connors. In the swamps of Florida, the lizard ambushes Spider-Man, nearly drowns him and throws him for almost half a mile. Instead of getting back into a fight he can't win, Spidey visits Dr. Connors' house instead, only to find his weeping wife. It turns out that Doc Connors is the lizard. He was experimenting to use lizard DNA to regrow his missing arm and transformed himself into a monster. Knowing who the lizard is, Spider-Man creates an antidote to his condition. He paddles out into the swamps of Florida and finds the lizard talking to alligators, planning to take over the world. Spidey slips from the wall, revealing himself, and fights the lizard and his alligator army. Eventually, he traps the lizard in a tower and is able to hold him still long enough to make him drink the antidote. Just before the lizard can take care of Spider-Man for good, he turns back to Dr. Connors. After reuniting the Connors family, Spider-Man promises to keep Kurt's alter ego a secret, so he gets J. Jonah Jameson to tear up the photos by making him think that they're fake. Back in New York, Peter Parker calls up Liz Allen to ask her on a date, but she angry Really hangs up on him. She's waiting on her one true love to call, Spider-Man. Our story ends with the promise of the very first returning Spider-Man villain.